What's going on YouTube? Giosna right here. So in today's video, we're discussing a brand new iOS vulnerability patched in iOS 18.4.1 that could potentially be very useful for jailbreak purposes if exploited. So if you take a look in here on the cve.org, you can see that there is the CVE 2025-31200. And this one was patched in iOS 18.4.1 by Apple. Now this is a vulnerability in core audio. And you can see it says, impact processing an audio stream in a maliciously crafted media file may result in code execution apple is aware of a report that this issue may have been exploited in an extremely sophisticated attack against specific targeted individuals on ios now this does sound promising and scary at the same time but it could be useful for jailbreak purposes since it leads to code execution or at least for tools like this one over here like iDevice toolkit or mdc0 or stuff like that that could tweak your device without being jailed broken with minimal exploit. Now, this is already in uh, development as a POC, proof of concept, and this developer over here apparently is looking into the vulnerability and trying to figure out what Apple patched, because the real vulnerability was not released. It's actually from Apple and Google Threat Analysis Group, so there is no proof of concept released. Neither of these parties have released any information about the vulnerability beside the CVE over here. Now, this developer is trying to piece it together, and they do have a lot of research over here even provided some code on how to trigger it and apparently they managed to make a lot of progress you can see that they actually created a couple of scripts to try to trigger the vulnerability and to create the maliciously crafted mp4 file that would essentially trigger the vulnerability in place now this could potentially be very useful for jailbreak purposes if properly exploited what we have in here right now is just kind of a write-up a diff of the versions to see exactly what was patched and a proof of concept to create a vulnerable mp4 file that would essentially trigger the vulnerability but it's not really an exploit so we're gonna have to wait more for that but from the change log over here on apple's security page it does look like something potentially useful so i would advise you if you're interested in jailbreaking to stay below ios 18.4.1 so 18.4 18.3.2 all of these would do don't update ios 18.4.1 it's a bad version to be on both in terms of battery performance and in terms of jailbreaking i'm gonna link this research down below if you want to take a look we're gonna watch it closely to see where it leads and i'm gonna update you if something interesting comes around this video is brought to you by rayboot a software that allows you to easily fix your device if it's stuck in recovery mode dfu mode and so on if your device is stuck for example in the dfu mode or you have a boot loop caused by a bad jailbreak then you can fix it with this tool pretty easily the uh, tool is available for both windows and mac os the Definitely check it out in the link below. Thank you for watching. I am GS Now. Till the next time, peace out.